Hey guys, just a very short video uh, discussing a, a topic that I think is very relevant um, in today's climate, let's say. Um, quite honestly, there is a real transparency between training for you and training for others. So many people out there that think that going to the gym means that you're in competition with everyone else. That going to the gym means that you have to compare yourself to others, that you have to uh, seek appraisal from others, and for others to tell you you're doing well, or for you to be better than your peers. When really training at a non-competitive level should be anything but competitive. It should literally be about you, yourself, enjoying what you do. No pressure, uh, no anxiety from feeling like you're underachieving. Just going to the gym, and simply doing it because it makes you feel good. I feel sorry for so many people in today's, um, like I say, climate because everyone feels somewhat pressured to be a part of the competitive side of whether it be bodybuilding or any other category. When, you know, 10 years ago, when I first started this, bodybuilding, bodybuilders knew there were bodybuilders. There was a very cult. There was a limited amount of us. We would compete. And it was cool because we always had the intention of competing. We started training because the intention was there to be a, a, a professional bodybuilder. We had a dream. I am concerned by how many people step in the gym now and have no direction and from the get-go think it's a competition. And come on social media, for example, and post pictures and hope that someone says you look good and this and that. Um, and I think a lot of the people that do compete, no disrespect, but don't have the right to be there in a sense that it wasn't their passion to compete. Like, they're not doing it for them. They didn't get into it and think, oh, I really want to be a great bodybuilder. What they've done is they've gone onto Instagram and they've seen that people are saying it's cool and that it's, it makes you an important person among society if you have a great physique. When competitive bodybuilders don't give a shit who on the street thinks you look good we care about winning shows we care about going to a competition and crushing everybody we don't care what we look like all year round we never have we literally just like to do what we do because we are bodybuilders through and through it's a discipline that we enjoy um, it trains a part of our mental aspect as well as our physical and it's a way of living so many people don't like that way of living yet conform to it because again they feel pressured by the majority that you have to look a certain way or that you have to do it because everybody's doing it. But it has lost a bit of sight, it has lost a bit of sight. It's not the same as it should be. Um, <laughs> it's become a fashion when fashion, as great as it can be, it can also be something quite damaging mentally. So many people I see do this and I noticed they're on Instagram for a while and then they disappear and I can't help but think when they've disappeared they're unhappy um, and this isn't a case of oh they disappeared off Instagram because they know that Instagram's bullshit because I know it's not you know I know some of these people personally and they go away and they will send a message perhaps out in a few months time how they've had a bad time they had to come away from social media blah 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 and that is because the the pressure that we create on ourselves and like I say, it's just crazy how many people don't really have a right to compete. It was never their intentions. Fall into it and try and follow that way of life and it fucks up the rest of their life. Because you have to understand, like, as a competitive bodybuilder, as a professional, everything I've done from the young age of, te like, you know, young teenager has been towards this. Everything has come behind this. Nothing else came before this. Whereas these people have got lives, got great jobs, you know, great potential for careers. They throw it in the gutter for bodybuilding. But it's not bodybuilding for the right reasons. Hopefully that video makes sense. I'm not trying to be depressing or anything. I'm just trying to explain that there's a lot of that going on. And it's very apparent. Um, you know, if you want to be a professional bodybuilder, if you love bodybuilding and, you know, competing, give it your all. Absolutely. Um, and if you train to train, train to train. Enjoy it. Don't let it pressurise you to the point that I would let it pressurise me. 
this is my job, this is my income, this is my life, my living, this is everything I've ever put my energy into. You guys have an opportunity to do other things. Don't waste it.